Hey y'all, sorry, this is part two. My alarm went off. But as I was telling you, oops, as I was telling you, and, and I'm not gonna apologize for being spicy because I'm, I'm, I'm spicy. When I don't feel good, when I'm PO'd, hell, I could be just spicy anytime and extra. So here I am. But anyway, um, so yeah, he got me a trifle in water. I'm thankful. 20 ounces. Aqua. Damn it. I wanted to see if they had those small um, waters in there. You know, the little, the little waters. Yeah. Don't tell me that. You just don't want to go back in there. But he, look what he got. He got a dad team hand Hey. You can't even cream sickle. You don't even drink water. And don't tell me it works because yes, that do. doesn't count. Yeah, does. Anyway, y'all. Oh, and here, here's the other Nancy Drew book. The last one. This one is Once Upon a Thriller. Doesn't she look? She looks ripe. Okay, I have my grandmother now addicted to these pens. <laughs> these are, and Judy, if you're watching, here's the pen I was talking about. See the gold, the black. Um, Mag Magna Tank, that's a great name. Um, smooth gel ink, comfort grip, clean both lines. This, the, I call this a sexy pen. So if you hear me talking about a pen, I don't care, get offended over the word sexy, but this son of a gun, oh, I almost said a word, is sexy, beyond sexy. Okay, I found this one. I did not want to get all these dang blasted things. Tell him to get me, let me borrow a cigarette. No. Um, the, the uh, Jolly Ranchers. I don't think I have this one. If I do, I'm going to give it to my friend and she'll just be surprised. But I don't think I found that one. I love erasers, you know, I can't help it. Okay. For my grandfather's birthday, I found him this and God forbid, I hope he doesn't already have it, but it's the police Ford matchbox. Got him that. Now you had to upraise the bag. Oh, and, and looky, looky here. Here's the other Caramello. Here, and they only had two Caillou books. I think I showed you one. I, I don't, did I? I don't know what I did. Anyway, there's Caillou. This is the Caillou that I, that I like. I like this version. My grandmother can't stand him. <laughs> she can't stand his voice, I guess. Anyway, I still keep her as family though. We'll, we'll be all right. I got myself one of these because when I was a little girl, I mean like two or three years old, I had three. I had a boat, I think a fire truck, and I'm not sure the other one. But then later on in life, when I was about 11 or 12, um, my, my father's uh, girlfriend's oldest daughter thought that these were hers. How the hell are they yours, witch, if you watched my video? when i had these when i was three years old you were nowhere in the picture anyway tell how mad i am because i still think about them you know they were a big part of me just like cookie monster anyway i got these for eric and grandma i do not like peanut butter crackers the only thing i like is peanut butter cookies with the hershey kisses on them and i make some slamming ones and i will be a bigger girl but you know what the hell with diabetes do you see I'm doing a video, compadre? Like, for real. You could have hold it up. You could have went around the block. Anyway, here's another one. Oh, and then here's my other scissors. These have um, glitter. I think the other ones, don't they have glitter? Yeah, they have glitter. And then um, I got these. I don't know if I already, I think, you know what? I bet you I do. But I can just snip the tails off and then, you know, or just do the um, other, no, I don't know make them different you know and then I guess I showed you this bag do I have another is that it yeah. holy so are you there. oh wait a minute hold Season on bleach. hold on y'all before Eric has a fit here's oh, the bleach okay. is this a good bleach I'm gonna do something stupid too yup mm -hmm. look how look how you you actually know something of me I LA's totally gonna... awesome bleach fresh scent you know what, y'all? almost got into a fight up in here. Mm-hmm. Because this skinny little, whatchamacallit, she wanted to act like... Well, that's kind of faint for... Hold on. Let's let's give it a little zhuzh. Well, oh, look at that Watch sexy yeah, damn... Look at that sexy car. What kind of car is that sucker? Corvette. Ooh, I like it. I likey-likey. Chevy. 
Yeah. Okay. We. Uh oh. Now I got a damn low battery. What the hell, Batman? I can't even see nothing. First, now. first my damn alarm, and now this. But when I zhuzh it up, I could smell it. But it's only for like cleaning a. I bought a used um, trash can and you know whatever. Okay, here are the seeds. Here's my cucumber munchers. Um, cucumber muncher again. That's what they look like. Sorry, y'all. I don't know if they're going to be the little ones, and that's why they're calling them muncher. Here is the bush. I tried to get four, you know. Because I thought, well, I guess I'll just charge you 25 Um, Judy, if you're watching, how the hell do I plant these? Um, I don't know how many. I think I only got two of them. Ooh, hello. I forgot I got them. Um, let me see. Let me see, y'all. Let me see. Let's start singing. Yeah, I got another. What is I thought that said Lisbonese. Onion white Lisbon bunching. I don't know. We gonna, we gonna try something. Um... Then I found the straight eights. Okay, so I got four of them. They like a lot of water. Kim forgets that and she shouldn't. And then there's um, Blue Lake 274. That's bush, so I don't know if that's different. And then I went ahead and got two kale. And I did grow this last year, I think, or was it the, was it last year I grew this or the year before? But I, I did think it grew. And then y'all, and then I found the chocolate frosted donut Kit Kat. That's one for you and I to share. And then, uh, cause grandma gets her own cause she's special. And then I got the Kit Kat birthday cake. I thought, why the heck not? So two of them. So Eric and I get to share cause we fed anyway. So, and then, um, <clears throat> What is that? Party what? Oh my gosh. You know what? I am so freaking glad that you said to drive because I mm, I would have to take a nap. I might go back in, in the back there on... Hey, simmer down now. Simmer down. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Heal. Oh. Chill. Oh, shit. Sorry. I just threw the candy bar. Oh my God. My hair is getting long and it's getting on my nerves. Well, this part's getting long. I've never had my hair this long in this part. Usually this part is like up here and this part is down there by now. But anyway, I'm rolling with it. So maybe you guys can help me. We have a lot of, I want to bring in some daffodils. I want to buy my grandmother. Oh my God, I'm running out of air. Um, I am so deathly sick and they can't even tell me a damn thing is wrong with me. But anyway, so I got these domes. How was I doing this? What was that? Was I doing it this way? Yeah, I think I was doing it this way. So I'm going to cut this off and this one and then keep that. Don't I thought I had three. Oh, sugar. Anyway, so I'm going to try to do something like this and then have like a flower pot or, you know, vase. And then that way I can try to bring in toxic plants so the cats can't get to them and my grandmother and me um, cause I'm about ready to bring in all the daffodils cause I want to see them. You know, I'm like the heck with you neighbors. You don't need to be checking out my sexy daffodils. Mind your business. Keep your eyes on your side of the street. You know, that's how I feel. I know I'm a very Christian, aren't I? <laughs> anyway, we're not going to go there. But anyway, so, um, yeah, sorry. This was part two. I totally forgot, you know, what time and that I had my alarm set for 11:30, and I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I'm, I'm being, you know, extra loud. Look at that. She got some pantyhose tights on too. Were we supposed to read something on the door? No. I don't know uh, what the. Time. I don't know what the heck time she. change. What is she looking at? Like she's staring at it hard. 8 oh, I bet you he enjoyed that cigarette. You lucky son of a biscuit head. No. You... Anyway, uh, mind your business. I'm talking to him. I ain't talking to you. Don't you give me no daggone look. I'm going to. I am 324 pounds and I'll yeah. let your ass out real fast, faster than yeah, a daggone right. pancake. Yeah, right. Look, just because I can't drop you yet and I drop myself first, that don't mean nothing. Anyway. <laughs> Three times. Shut up. Why you count? I didn't do nothing. Why you count, son? Why you count? Anyway. He tripping, he tripping y'all. 
When you've been with someone 20 some years, mm, it, you, all words are free. Wrong. Look, I haven't told them that we're not, we're not, uh, that we're not fiance and fiance. Yes, we are. I, I, I meant to tell them that and then my alarm went off. But we're just friends. No, we're not. Because I can't tolerate his <laughs> attitude anymore, y'all. So I laid the law down. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. Just because you're a year older than me doesn't mean, and I'm bigger than you. So <laughs> anyway, I laid the law down and I'm like, you know what? I'm done with your shiznick and, and, and how you don't want to obey. And <laughs> I, I had to throw that in there because I know some dummies are going to believe it. But anyway, and this woman better know how to back up because I put her ass in the trunk. Um, no, y'all seriously though, I was, I was at the, um, the, one of the garages, right? I think I was on, I, I went around the corner, you know, around the thing so many times in the garage. I forgot what floor I was on. And I told the man when we got in the elevator, cause you gotta take, um, you gotta take the, um, can you help me out? I can't think. You gotta go in the garage and then get out of the car, go in that garage. And then that garage will take you. You have to walk over get in the building and then if you have to go up then you have to go in another daggone garage okay well this woman this older lady okay no shame in the age because i'm really going on 121 really i am y'all want my autograph because i'm 121 pretending i'm 48 and a half <clears throat> anyway why in the hell did this woman okay they have a glass thing where you know the where you go into the door for the garage that's, I mean, go in the elevator that's in the garage. Okay, they have a bench. Her, I'm not exaggerating, y'all. My grandmother can tell you. Because I heard this noise. And I thought, oh my God, did she hit my car? Her, <laughs> it ain't funny. Her, because it'll happen to me one day if it hadn't already. But her freaking trunk was literally almost sitting. Well, hell, she was all up in it. But her trunk was sitting on the damn bench because some of the things they have a bench i swear to god i'm gonna pass out you better know how to dial 911. but um oh there's a sexy car again oh damn you all can't y'all saw a little bit of it mm. Whew. Yeah, expensive sixty thousand dollar plus well then then him and i can have fun in the dollar tree Jimmy. he won't eye roll at me when i want five boxes of tissues but any who's yeah I, I like turning and trying to look and watch where the hell she was because I thought maybe she was plastered to my butt, you know, my car. No, girlfriend had her trunk sitting on the daggone wooden bench. And then she, like, I went to move and she went to pull up some and you could hear, <laughs> I said, oh my God, she better not blame me because she's older. I love older people, don't get me wrong. My, my sister um, uh, called me an old people lover. Or I love old people. Well, damn straight, I was raised with them. They're my favorite. I've only met one that I don't like, you know, or maybe two. But old people are daggone cooler than people my age, you know, especially if they're spicy and feisty. Like my cousin, we could talk about anything. We could talk about why our boobs are down to our knees and how come they're not up, you know, like a damn chin rest. And, um, I mean, we would all, and we would go, we would get even raunchier than that, y'all. We talk about the man's body. Um, but we would all, I would always be fussing about boobs because right now, I don't know where the hell they are. I guess they're now they're part of my stomach, but I, I want them where they, where they look like beach balls and I can just lay my head. Shut up. Somebody might need to hear this. I might need a layoff anyway, but what? I don't care. I ain't making no part three. That's what I said. You might. But anyway, so, um, yeah, I probably stopped myself from saying something to y'all, but this is how I am. Some, my, my cousin, right, who passed um, years ago, I miss her. She was my favorite cousin. That was so ignorant to take and pull out like that. You ain't, you ain't in that big of a damn hurry, son. No, I ain't talking to you. I'm talking to him, her, whoever. Um, shit, what was I going to say? Oh, it was, oh, my cousin... My cousin Virginia, we, her and I just about peed because when I when I get that when I get the going extra and getting spicy and on my different topics because I know what I can say to her, and then I don't give a damn who's around us. 
So if you sit in our table, you're just going to either pee yourself, sneeze and laugh. I don't know. You're just going to hear it. And, um, I mean, it's not like, you know, really bad, but you know, I talk about boobs and putting them in flower pots and having the hanging baskets as earrings and trying to have them where the hell they're supposed to be. Cause gravity is just taking them down. I don't need another set of knees. You know what I mean? I don't. And look at this shit. What am I supposed to do with this daggone turkey gobbler? I can't store leftovers in it. So why do I have it anyway? But anyway, so my cousin said, you never, what a, did we not? We were supposed to read the door. No, it's just. I the woman just stopped and read the door. We might have missed valuable information. It's from eight Maybe to we nine. were supposed to wear red underwear today or something. No, it's eight to nine time. Eight to nine what? Time to oh, I don't know. Clothes. Anyway, so like my like I said, I'm trying to tell you this for five hours. My cousin said that you never know what's coming out of her mouth. With a big old smile on her, I miss her. Oh my God, I miss her. Dang it, I li life is so boring. I remember one time we went to the horse races. I guess I was a kid. And she was yelling or something. And her daggone teeth fell over the fence in the racetrack area. And there's her teeth. <laughs> I don't know how the hell she eventually got them. I don't think a horse came over and gave them to her. But, yeah, I mean, I love her. I don't have no other cousin like her, you know. Um, but anyway... So I'm going to go, y'all. I've been sitting here for I don't know how many how many minutes was the other one. And I can't help it for the cuss words. If you all felt like I did, then then you'd be like, Kim, you know, I mean, it doesn't matter. I don't I don't give a darn. I've already warned y'all I'm going to be how I am. Because if I can't be on, in here and, and be how I am, then I no, I don't need to be here at all. So if you, you can't stand extra and spicy and sassy... And tell it like it is. Because this is me. This is me. This ain't no put on for this YouTube. Eric, please tell them. Eric will not lie to you. He will not lie about a damn thing. He won't even lie for me. Please tell them this is how I am in public. Yes, she is. And at home. She is. And at a restaurant. She is. Everywhere, right? Yep. See? Told you. Ooh, I'm glowing. Look at that. I could be a I could be a strawberry shortcake wannabe. The fat one. Um <laughs> Anyway, y'all, it's been real. It's been fun. I'm glad that my coughing, I can feel it. I got a big old one ready to come up because I'm trying I'm trying not to talk, y'all, and it's so hard. Man, Speed Racer, you only in a dad going, uh, good night. Give me whiplash. But any who's, um, yeah, I'm getting hungry now, and it's only 1130. No, it's 12. Huh? 1202. What do you got? At 12 02. How you're looking, you're looking my alarm was supposed to. Uh, I know that's my time. It was 11 30 when anyway. I like all my little bags, I hope I don't rip them. But now I gotta make, I gotta make sure to keep some of the bags in Eric's car and some in my car. Yeah, mm -hmm. and they're little Dollar Tree bags. I mean, they so daggone little, you know, you only like 25. And I wonder, they have two self scanners in here. And I wonder, I, oh, it was, oh, that's the woman I'm standing at the end of the, at the register, right? I hope my battery lasts so I can say this. And this black lady is going like that. And I don't know if she said ma'am or what I saw was doing that. And she goes, do you work here? I'm not even wearing a lanyard. And I was like, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> I almost was going to say, do you need anything? But then she probably tried to put me on the register and I would not know how to do that. I'd be pushing, pushing all kinds of buttons, getting nothing. I'd be like, I can't help your orders $500. You shouldn't ask me if I worked here. But anyway, it was sweet. She was probably in a hurry to get nowhere. Where's that sexy car at? Gone. That man's coffee's more important. He couldn't even turn, turn the, I should turn y'all around. I'm getting ready to start singing the wheels on the bus. Oh, damn y'all. This ain't a handicap, is it? No. I hope not because that one is. The front one is. Did I tell y'all about my water? My water. Yeah. I told I told my bottom. grandmother, why the heck do I speak the way I do? Water. 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 How do you say it? Water. Now see you say it like I do, water. Why do you get listen? I dare somebody come on here and correct me. It's water. 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 Water, damn it, water. <laughs> All right, let me turn 
that or it's uh, a C. I don't even know a song to sing because I, I feel like. <laughs> oh my God. Isn't this a great way to feel like when you're dying, y'all? This is great. It's fabulous. Oh shit, there's a sexy car. Oh, rev that engine, baby. Damn it, I love it. <laughs> No, you know I love an engine. Well, I should have my Firebird. Your your Firebird didn't even have my step. Well, my well, stepmom. Um, at the time, she had a daggone car that she started that bastard up. Sorry, and it was like, rah, 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 rah. I mean, it was like so loud. I'm like, yes, let's get that roaring going, y'all. Anyway. <laughs> I haven't been so daggone extra in forever, man. Y'all gonna be like, Kim, I hope you stay sick forever because I like this side of you. Or maybe you don't like this side of me. <laughs> I don't really care. Please let me know. I, I want to know. Oh, crap. What is that? Stupid team Snapchat. What are they? I hate Snapchat. I don't know. What the hell are you supposed to do with that damn thing? I growl when my friends send me something. And then it tells me that I have something and ain't, there ain't no thing there. And I'm like, well, I, I like her shirt, um, but it, it would hug all my fat. Okay, I'm gonna go, y'all, because I was gonna say it's past my bedtime. I like that. Um, no, but normally I would still be in bed, maybe. Yes. So I'm really proud of myself. But yeah, I'm not even. I'm not. You know, y'all want to calculate my purchase? <laughs> go ahead. But I don't come here a lot. I don't come here a lot. I don't get out. I did, ex I mean, and I mean, there's stuff that I didn't find and maybe I didn't need the 25 bags. How many bags did we get? Six or something? I mean, I, I think it's more than four. One, two, three. Where the hell the other one? Four. It might be five or six, but I did put the princess. And see, I can't, I can't like move my head that fast because I feel like, do y'all like this color? Does it look like a fake black? And look at that. I missed. Oh, I'm so ugly. Anyway, I, shut up, I am. It, but this part looks black. This part look like ain't got no dag on purple. I hear the purple shining right there. Anyway, I had to take my headband out. Oh, see, now that makes my head feel weird. Oh, man. Maybe I have brain cancer or a tumor or something because, I don't know, it, it's just not right. But anyway, y'all, it's been fun. It's been real. I'm going to get off of here and go. And um, I hope you guys have a good one. And um, I have to make sure not to mess this up. Um, you know, and put it the way that it's supposed to go or what have you. But yeah. And I hope that I was able to share a laugh. So if I was, let me, down, let me know down below. If, um, and if you want to cuss me out because you had an accident. Okay. Um, bring it on. Um, I mean, I, I'd rather you have a laugh than have an accident. You know what I'm saying? And I don't mean like, how do I say this? Like you wish you had a diaper. Okay. That kind of accident, not like any other kind of accident, but no, no accidents, just laughter. I, 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 I said somewhere that if the only purpose of me, if my only purpose in life is to make people laugh, then I'm good. I'm good. And when I was in the doctor's office, I must have said something because I'm very loud when I talk. And like I told you guys, I don't know. And my friend's probably going to cut me off because I don't know how many minutes I have left. But anyway, um, and I said something to somebody that I don't know what my purpose is. And I'm not going to freaking cry because I can cry on a dime. But um, and I, when I said that, the black lady who I was talking to, she goes like this and she's pointing at my grandmother. You know, that my purpose is to care for her. Well, my grandmother and my grandfather took me in and they didn't have to. You know, they could have left me on some street corner, you know, like my mother's been wanting, my birth mother's been wanting to do or did. Um, and, but no, they took me in. Well, my granny, come to find out, my grandmother's mother, my granny was done the same way. And my granny was given, because my granny, uh, my, my, her mom, did, I guess, didn't want her. And she got taken by an aunt or um something so the same stuff that happened to me happened to my granny i never knew that i never freaking knew that but anyway i love my granny i can't there's some people i can't talk about 
without crying. And that's my granny, my Juanita, now my grandfather. And there's another person that I will, especially my granny, y'all. She died when I was 11 and that was too damn early to go. But anyway, um, yeah, my granny was my warrior. Damn it. She, anyway, um, why did I say all that? I don't even know. I get to talk and then I forget where the point or, you know, where I was going with something, but, um, oh, the purpose and stuff. But yeah, I mean, they raised, they raised me since I was like two or three years old. They took me in and, um, I'm going to do everything until the day I die, you know, to, to, um, you know, we're, we're a tag team. You know, my grandmother calls us, look, Steph, she's reading the damn thing. I need to go up there and read it. I told you. Oh my is. God. Um, but yeah, she calls us the night riders because we'll be out one o'clock in the morning, mailing a bill, mailing something or three o'clock in the morning. We don't give a shit, you know? So, and I want to get that. I want to, you know what? Remind me, I need to, um, figure out where to put that. I wonder if I get that on, the, I'm, I'm getting a tattoo right here. I'm getting my grandpa's name. I'm getting his, um, nickname was Jack and I'm getting that Jack symbol and his numbers were 333. Three, three. And I think on this side, I'm going to get my grandma. I think I'm going to put her here because I was going to put her below, but I think I'm going to put her here. And then I'm going to get, um, I'm going to get them to do the word in there, like the tattoo, if I can handle this one. And then, um, this one, I'm going to get her name written in her handwriting, either cursive or print, whichever one she likes. And then I'm going to get them and the tattoo artist in his or her handwriting to put night riders like real slick looking and then her numbers are 222 mine are 777 eric's are 555 um or i like 721 because that's my you know birth um things but i just like seven i don't know why um anyway so now i've got to go because i've got saliva in my throat and i've got you guys are on my tissue so we have to part ways now um but yeah i had fun you know spending my uh time with you guys and um i guess i will see y'all later maybe i don't know sweet jesus of god um people are freaking nuts and that's why also i wanted to come early to get away from these um these crazy people and you can see they are all crazy and it's only what i can't see your um 12, probably 12 30 or 12 something 12, but anyway 12 13 only 12 13 yeah. wow all right y'all well my battery has been nice um if i go anywhere else I won't be able to show you and then I'll try to do the other video somehow, some way. I would love to show y'all what I got at Goodwill um, when Eric and I went. When did we go last week and yeah. or something? Like or no, did you have off and we went? You took that day off, remember? Yeah. Did we go then? Yes. On that day or was it the weekend? I don't know. But I found a really, oh my gosh, I found some cool daggone stuff for like, for coming from my area. And the, the dollar, I mean, the goodwill that it was, excellent prices. Excellent prices. Yes, indeed. Okay, I got to go because I got to get this snot rocket out of my face before I shoot up in the air. I hope you all have a great weekend. I hope you stay blessed. Don't be stressed because it ain't no time for that. You know, don't give it any energy. People want to get on your nerves. Just keep on walking. And when you feel down, you know, talk to God. He will send people. He will anoint people because that yesterday... I'm not going to tell you how I felt. I'm not going to tell you what I wanted to do. Um, but y'all, no, I'm not going to go there. But anyway, but he had people in my path, like that black lady who was sitting in the office, like that black guy who was laughing at me. And then I started talking to him and we were talking about chicken and I was getting awfully, you know, feisty because diabetic people aren't supposed to have fried chicken. Well, you know what? They can kiss my hiney hole. Um... And then, um, then he got called back and then I was talking to the other lady and then she was telling me about, oh, no, 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 you can't have fried chicken. You got to have, you know, broiled chicken. I'm like, what the hell is broiled chicken? I don't know about no broiled chicken. And then she told me that you could have baked chicken. I'm like, okay, I know what that is. But, um, Kim ain't no cooker, you know, uh-uh. I can cook chicken special. Um, I'm pretty sure I told you about that, but I don't know how much time I have. So if you want to know, I'll, you know, let you know down below. We have a Jimmy John's cars riding by yeah. but anyway i'm just letting y'all know don't let the devil win don't tell him i mean don't let him tell you that you are not good enough because i am struggling 
I am struggling so bad with my self-worth. I know I don't have any. And, but when I, when I say that, it's because when I go to patient first and they, they act like I'm not worthy of, you know, care, it makes my self-worth feel like I don't have any. Then when I go to like to the hospital and I have the same kind of thing, and now my doctor, we're not even gonna talk about that because now I'm not gonna have one in a couple months. Not my, not me because she doesn't wanna be my doctor and I think she's lying about what she's telling me. But it's all good in the hood, hon, because if you gotta lie, go for it. Um, but I don't, I don't see why these people think I'm such a bad person and I'm a horrible person. And then the doctors don't wanna to listen to you. They want you to take that medicine. They don't give a damn how it makes you feel. They don't give a darn, cause I could keep saying damn, but you know, they just don't care. They're not listening to you. They're not compassionate. I want a doctor that's gonna be like, look, this is what, you know, I wanted you to do, but I'm gonna to listen to you and we're gonna, you know, try to meet in the middle. Ain't nobody wanna meet in the middle because they're getting paid for, you, you know, for giving you all these damn pills and shit. And why do I wanna take a pill that's gonna cause me pain when my weight's already doing that to me? Oh my God, I'm spitting a river. But anyway, I'm, I'm gonna go because I could, I could get up on my high horse and I ain't trying to hurt no horse today by getting on it. So we're just gonna leave it at that and, and, and get off of here. But, um, but anyway, it's been real y'all. Just, you know, I mean, if you, if you need a pep talk or something, step it down below, come, come down below and, and write to me and, you know, we can talk, we can, we can, you know, um, what do you call it? We can, um, you know, share, encourage, you know, whatever. I don't know because I don't, I don't want nobody, you know, getting, you know, down and, and depressed and feel like that they're alone. And because depression and anxiety, it, it's no, it's no joke. It ain't no damn joke at all, you know? And, um, and I keep mine, I keep mine pretty quiet. And the medication, even, even, even you know, the Paxil, I'm on Paxil 30, it's not touching it. And now she gave me Butrin, which I haven't looked that up to see if that's gonna kill me. And then I'm supposed to take that at 8.30. Well, hell, I'm not even up at 8.30 slow your roll damn it now you want me to get up at 8 30 just to take one pill and then she wanted me to take the butrin and the paxil together i don't know if i can do that <sighs> anyway y'all and the ozempic you see that's really oh my god show you my things um but i'm trying to show you my my, my tire down here my spire tire oh hell no i'm talking country anyway yeah we ain't losing no weight with that either but of course i'm not eating right because i'm eating starches and carbohydrates and everything if I feel like I'm going to die, damn straight, I'm going to have a cupcake. Get out of my face, you know? And then I saw on Instagram or Facebook, phone, please let me say this, but I saw on Instagram or Facebook, if you lick the icing first and then you left with the cake part, you got a muffin, girl, or boy, daggone it, that's right. You eat that daggone icing first and then you got a muffin and you're all good to go. So you don't have to worry about it. <laughs> High fives, right? All right, y'all, it's been real. I swear to God, it's been fun. Um... I'm, I'm glad I came on here and spent, oh my gosh, now I got dandruff in my eyebrows. Look, I cut these jokers and I didn't even wax them yet. <laughs> I'm walking around looking rabid probably. I don't even know. It's all good though. I like scaring people. <sighs> Let me tell you what, I'm growing. I'm growing y'all because some of these people in here, they saw, oh crap. They saw me and they wanted to like get out of the aisle or whatever. And I just kept on rolling. I kept on pushing my little buggy and ignoring them little hoe rats. And I just kept on going. And yes, I'm a Christian and I talk like a wretched, I don't know what, I don't care. My seatbelt's getting tight. Oh, look at that old car, that hoopty. Um, but yeah, I, I am so proud of myself because I would let people get to me. And today, it might only be one day, y'all, one day, but guess what? Kim kept it cool and that daggone little speed monster that was racing past me because I'm fat and I'm waddling and I was having a lot of hip pain because now my hip pain's coming back um I let her have it but she didn't know I was talking to her but I was fussed at it through the whole damn store you know and then then I let it go I released it I let it go but I'm glad that I said something and I know damn well she heard me and I don't care because you shouldn't act ignorant I could have been an old senior citizen person that you know doesn't know anything where the hell i'm at and can't ha hardly walk you know and then you want to rush around me like you like what's the rush you know 
Nobody's going to take the crap that you want, and you probably didn't find anything anyway. Cheers, y'all. But, you know, I, I don't care. But I'm proud of myself, damn it. Let me pat myself on the back. Because usually I let everybody get on my nerves. I know. I know damn well that I'm fat. I'm ugly. I got rolls. I got thip hip. Don't ask me what my butt looks like because I don't know what it looks like. But I think that's the only good, that's the only part of my body that I like because I don't know what it looks like. But Eric tells me that I have a fine tail. My grandmother says I, my butt's okay. So I just got to believe them. Hell, I can't even twist around and look in a damn mirror to look at my butt. I'm like, whatever. I know, TMI, nobody wants to talk about my butt. But I'm serious. I'm not cute. I don't think this is cute. You know, look at this big old forehead. You know, look at my whopping nose. That looks like a, a pumpkin um, stem. You know, my gappy ass tooth space. I still haven't found out if this spot that, you know, where my, that was behind my root. I still haven't gone because it just fell off and I left it and then the skin grew back. Um, I know, ew, but I don't like pain and I don't know how they gonna get the root, you know, when it's in there. Um, but I, for when I was ever, since I was a kid, I had a spot and then when I got older, like, you know, older, older, 20 or 30 or whatever, it, it, the spot grew. So I don't know if it's cancerous. I don't know if I lost it to cancer or not. I don't know. And now I'm afraid I'm going to lose the next one, but whatever. It is what it is. But my dentist didn't want to give me, a, um, you know, them, them plates because he said it would mess up my teeth, yada, yada, yada. That's why y'all should floss. I don't, well, I don't know. It's not going to, it's not going to help with the spot, but you know what I'm saying? Okay, guys, I don't know how many cotton picking times I told y'all that I was going to get on off of here. So, um, you know, drink some water every time I said that, but I have no idea. But, um, so I'm going to get off of here, <laughs> drink some water and I'll talk to y'all later. And if I bored you, then I can't help it. But I, I had fun. So that's all that matters that I had fun. This looks so wretched and stupid. <laughs> but anyway, um, yeah, this is the first time I'm wearing my hair down. Damn. Who am I? Look at all these hands. Well, he wasn't handsome. I don't know where that car went. I guess it's not. Gone. I know. I see. He pulled out that way, but he rode around forever. He should ride it around again and make the fat chick jealous. Enough. I am too fat. Then what the Sims hell is this inner tube tire that I'm carrying around? Your fluid. You got fluid. Not and fast. and we're not going to talk about the hips either. We ain't. We ain't, okay. Anyway, y'all. Have a blessed one. I hope I didn't make you laugh until you peed. And if I did, oh, well, join the club. We'll start a club. We have to give it a name. But anyway, until then, y'all, I don't I don't know. I'm, I, I might be back to show you. I don't know. My Goodwill stuff's kind of like everywhere. But I, I will try to maybe show you my other Dollar Tree stuff. Isn't that good? You know, people holding the door. I was trying. I had all the bags, right, and the bleach in my hand. And I, I'm, I'm going to tell you. No, I, I had it in my hand. Yes, I did. Don't let anyway. So I'm coming, I'm, I'm, you know, coming out of the door and I'm trying to hold the door with my body and my hand. And this lady's trying to take it from me. And I told her, I said, I was trying to hold the door for you. And she goes, what did she say? Well, well, no, I'm holding the door for you. <laughs> I was like, I said, okay, then. Cause I was going to fight her. Cause you know, she's taking away my blessing to be able to bless her. But then I don't want to, be a witch and then not let her bless me so you know <laughs> but i wanted to hold the door anyway y'all let me sh oh shit damn it got me again when you went in there somebody blew the horn real loud i'm in here jumping and cussed so them two are not my fault and they getting spicy y'all spicy this is not what I wanted to drive in anyway I'm gonna go because I want to see if if you hear me yell it's because they didn't have the um, what is it called? Cream sickle. I was going to say something else. Yeah, I told him it's like a Slurpee or whatever. Oh, Lord, don't tell me this man's going to come over here and want to give me a facial. I wonder what the hell I'm doing in the parking no. lot. Right. That's a lot of pallets. But anyway, guys, so I'm going to go, and I guess I will talk to you guys later. I hope you guys have a blessed one, and if you don't hear from me, then the dear Lord took me. That's all I can say. And, um, why did she kick the door? Go smack her. 
We don't kick the Dollar Tree well, door. She didn't want her hands on the door. Oh Pantyhose. my god. She, keep the she wearing pantyhose leggings. And the damn top don't even go with the damn right. color green. Now I'm turning into fashion police, y'all. <laughs> anyway, bye. Have a good one. Thanks for watching.